Hey everybody, this is Amir Khan from Century 21 AAA Realty, the story of British Columbia, Canada, the Greater Vancouver area. Today is day 17 of my 21 exercises in 21 days to raise $2,100 for the Easter Seals of BC and Yukon. And I'm going to be attempting the uh, drop zone, um, which is going to be held on the 10th of September 2020 at the Guinness Towers in downtown Vancouver. The exact address for that is 1055 West Hastings Street. And it's a 25 plus skyscraper, so I'll be rappelling down from there from the roof. Uh, so please help me help the kids. This is just solely to make sure that I can get some funding for the kids due to the COVID. All charities are really struggling right now. So please do whatever you can um, and any amount is fine. You don't have to donate hundreds of dollars. Whatever you feel comfortable with is fine. It'll help the kids and it'll make a big impact on, on even a, any donation amount you do to. Now getting to the exercise today, day 17 is bicycle crunch. So it's a great exercise for your upper abs, your mid and lower abs as well, as well as your obliques on the sides, if done correctly. So before attempting any exercises, please make sure you consult with your doctor, make sure you consult with your fitness coach, fitness, um, uh, anyone that you have uh, for fitness, make sure it's safe for you to do them. Once it's okay, they have given you the green light, then go ahead and continue them. This is a great exercise for your core again, as I said, and it really, if done correctly, it, it, it engages your core and you get a really, really nice, strong, um, core core of your body so let's get started and i'll show you the techniques in them first thing you need to do is make sure you find a nice flat surface and a mat or something a carpet or something that's comfortable for you so once you have that lay flat and you can do bicycle clench now the bicycle clench is like riding a bicycle but the one of the things don't keep your elbows close to you try to put them apart lay flat so make sure your elbows are straight up your knees are supposed to be feet up apart and then what you're doing is you're bringing the opposite leg and you're turning. So make sure you don't lift yourself up. You just need to raise your shoulders, turn to the side. Again, raise your shoulders, turn to the side. So that's what you're doing. You're just going from one side to the other side. And, and as you're doing that, try to bicycle backwards. Instead of going forward, go backwards. So that helps as well. So going side to side once again. Let's get started. So from here, go one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I feel the burn now. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. And 20 and 21. There we go. So we just did 21. Bicycle crunch. Great exercise for your core once again. And please um, help me get the funding for the kids uh, for the Easter Seals. And uh, any questions, anything you have, if you, do, if you want to give cash or checks, please call me. I'll be more than happy to meet with you and uh, help you with the donations and collect for the kids. And again, if it's anything over $25, then you will get a CRA tax receipt. But again, consult with your accountant. And it's a great tax write-off for you for next year as well. But once again, talk to an accountant. Well, thank you so much once again for everybody for watching. Uh, once again, today was day 17, the bicycle crunch. And I hope to see you tomorrow. But please kindly help me uh, donate for this cause. It's a great cause helping the kids. Thank you so much once again.